response to your question there, how to make that base on that signet ring. So what I did first, I made this pad, this outline, and then I extruded it out, and it came up with this. Now I made a line, as you can see in the top viewport, because uh, it's kind of a shield shape is what you're looking for. So I made this shield, uh, when we get done, we're going to wire cut this now. So, let's see if we can do this. We'll go to wire cut, which is right here. I'll go a little slow for you. There you go. Now we're going to select our cutting curve. And we're going to select our poly surface. You can see the directions up there. Now sometimes you can see you have to go with this little weird play with it. Let me try the direction. And let's see about uh, let's try C. Okay. Now you'll see that it highlighted yellow and part of it didn't. The yellow part will be cut away. We want to keep the yellow part. So I'm going to come up to the top. I'm going to say flip. And I'm going to click that. I get rid of the curve. And there you have your basic shape. Now I'm going to come over here to the right viewport. And I'm just going to rough this up quickly for you. And I think we'll just start a little curve here. this All right. and let's use our wire cut again it's up here now wire cut let's see if we can do this get okay, right on the first time right there I pick my poly surface and let's go with my direction I think we're gonna go with an X let's see and let's see what happens uh, there we go. Oh, I missed part of it. So let's try this again. There's a sliding curve. There. And there you go. The yellow part will be cut away. So now there we have that portion of the ring so far. Now what we'll do, you want to make that recessed so you can put your uh, skull in there. We'll come over here. We'll dupe the edge right up here, front viewport. We'll just grab it like that. There's your edge, as you can see. And now I'm going to just hit the joint. I'm going to come up here to offset, and I'm going to go just through point for right now. And I'm in the top viewport, and I'll just guesstimate like that. And as you can see. There's your offset. Now I want to uh, explode it for a minute. And I'm gonna, you need that room for those letters that you want to put in there. So I'll drag it down like that. I'll use my trim. And I'll cut out those parts. And then we'll join them. Now we'll extrude them. Go both sides if you want, whatever distance you want, and then we'll use our booyah difference. And there you have your foundation for the ring that you're trying to make. All right, as they say, keep it simple, stupid. That's my philosophy, they won't kiss formula. So, I hope that helped you. All right.